Greetings everyone, my name is Altarian and welcome to Insurmountable. This is a strategy roguelite adventure game, guys. Where we as a brave uh, human being are going to conquer this beautiful, beautiful mountain. By pointing, clicking and uh, looking for places to sleep, food, energy, resources and dangerous terrain. Uh, we are going to try and, uh, and do our very best. Now, I wanted to try this on the highest, highest difficulty. Just to get a sense of feeling of what it really is. Because I, I, I tried it on normal um, to see what it's all about. And I found it quite interesting. But I really want to see how horrible this would be. And if we will ever reach the top of the mountain... The, I think that's the goal. Insurmountable. That is far. Wow, guys, I really thought I was close when I tried it, but god damn, that's far away. You cast your gaze over the enormous mountain landscape. You have traveled across the globe seeking out adventure. But this island is like nothing you have ever seen before. As far as you can tell, it is largely unexplored. The only information you could find were a few rumors about an unknown occupying force. On the way there, you stumbled across abundant property and lost places. You wondered what happened here, what secret in this island is keeping. Then you shake your head. It might be nice to have some answers, but your goal is clear. Reach the summit. That is why you are here. That is what drives you. So, it is point and click, we can move left and right, we can zoom out. And, as you can see, we can even click everything. I think if we can click... Yeah, I think we even can click at the top, and it will automatically show us a route. So, that's funny. Uh, I have not tried that, we're not going to do that, because if you see at the bottom, we've got our sanity. Uh, if we fall, take damage, or see horrible stuff, we got a body temperature, which is quite logic. Energy and oxygen, because the higher you go... The uh, more difficult it is to breathe. We got a backpack. We have a tent to sleep in, which has three uses. We have a climbing tool, which uh, gives us um, less energy cost. So, for example, if we have, I don't know, let's say, uh, hurt our leg, we get a little bit penalty on that. And with this, we can compensate some body heat tea and some canned food. Um, we need to sleep, of course. Our timer clock for sleep is at the left bottom. This is the weather. This is the altitude. Death zone is 6,000. I don't... At 6,000 hate, you reach a death zone. In death zone, you lose oxygen. Okay, so that's what it means. Um, yes, each different... Let's see. Let's start moving towards there. Let's zoom a little bit in. Ooh, let's look at it. Ooh, nice. Oh, you are a brave, brave woman, I must say. Okay. We're gonna descend here. I actually like to zoom it in a little. Uh, let's say we'll zoom it like this to keep it a little bit more realistic, I see. So this is our first icon. This is probably an encounter. Mm. A gust of wind catches you and you almost fall into a deep fissure. You flail wildly with your arms, trying to keep your balance. Suddenly, someone grabs your wrist and pulls you back to the edge. Oh, that was close. Just a second later and you would have fallen to your death. That would be an epic adventure, we just started. Your knee's still weak, you take a look to your rescue at your rescuer. She's a young woman in a threadbare anorak. There is a green stone fastened around her neck with a leather strap. Fascinated, you stare at the hand carved charm. Its soft glow is almost hypnotizing. She smiles and hands you a much needed provision. I accept the gift. A strange feeling overcomes you, and you are sure you have been in a situation before, déjà vu? Hmm, distracted, you place her gift into your back. When you look back, the strange woman is gone. Truly bizarre, but you're grateful. <gasps> a climbing axe! Wow! This is a tool. It gives us minus 10 energy cost for everything. Thank you. That's a very good beginning. It's a very good... I see, so those things are quite random. So let's zoom out. We have a cave. This is which we can explore and sleep. You have a treasure chest to find items and more talking. 
We can also completely say, nah, -uh, I want to go completely to that side. But that's not our goal. We need to go up. We need to go up, up, up. And what is the best way? We do not know. We're probably going to go through all ways. And if you can see here at the left, there's some sort of, um, yeah, there it is. Some sort of shrine. It gives bonuses, as I experienced. And I noticed that if we climb, for example, I just climb one height, I must say. That uses less energy than it would if I come towards this one. This, use, this immediately uses a lot more energy. Are we going to camp right now? I don't think we do. Can we go there? We can go there. I think we're gonna go like this. There we go. So we must try to descend and ascend per one altitude, if we can at least. It's not that we have a choice con uh, every time. There we go. You discover a buried chest. Dig it out. It will cost us energy and time. And you immediately see what it will cost if we go hoover over this icon. At left side, we got nothing. If you go to the chest, it immediately tells us where we're gonna be. Yes, let's dig out the chest. Find some canned food. Perfect. That's actually very necessary because it gives energy. We're good. We still got... We got a couple of hours before we can sleep. But where are we going to sleep? Let's see. Do we have anywhere else a tent? I don't see anywhere else a tent. And I think it would be stupid to... Um... Continue. Uh, there we have one, but how much time will it cost us? Well, not that much, actually, if you see. Yes, and it will not consume our full energy. But can we go, first of all, towards here? Yeah, let's do that. Because I want to see if we can get to the shrine first. Or to that uh, special icon. See what we can get. And then maybe we can go here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's the plan. That's the plan. We've got enough energy. We will get there before night time. Or maybe at night time. But that's okay. We'll get there eventually. Okay, now let's get higher. Oh, okay, we've got a first mark icon. This is a rough terrain. It could uh, activate or trigger an event. Mostly negative. Ooh, while staring at the starry sky, you notice there a shooting star. Now I can choose what to get back. Some sanity or some energy. I'm gonna go with the sanity. Because that's something that we cannot regain. Or maybe we can regain it by sleeping. I'm not very sure. So we go here, 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 and there, and then we sleep. Perfect, before night time. Six o'clock, and it's not, not really night time, it just gets really dark. You enter an extensive cave. Uh, I actually will read it at the beginning, because uh, afterwards it's not that important to read it. It's all mostly the same uh, options. So I can find a corner to sleep. I can wake the stranger. You enter an extensive network of caves. Towards the rear, you notice an extinguishable campfire. Lying in front of it is a stranger, bundled up under a fur blanket. Let's wake him up. You approach the mountaineer, but he doesn't react. You bend over and gently shake him. The stranger blinks at you in bleary disbelief and sits up. After a while, he begins to clear away his camp and pack up his belongings. Before he goes, he reaches into his pack and shares a provision with you. You thank the stranger, but he... Pays you no heat. What? You give me a tent? I think that is like the jackpot. Let's just say honestly, if we... This is necessary to sleep. Wow, we've got two tents. I'll lie down and sleep. Yeah, now we're gonna go sleep. Inside the case, we obviously don't need tents. Of course, we can use it, but uh, the tent blocks more of it. So we need to sleep briefly or we need to sleep long. We go long and we gain energy. Yeah, so we don't get any sanity back. So if we can get sanity back either way, probably gonna do that. Nightfall. Okay, okay, it's night time. Um, it is mm, uh, 4.45 in the morning. Where can we go? There's a lot of stuff over here. We're gonna have to climb very rough terrain. This is all ice. Is there anything at the right side? Yeah, that's... You know, if, if you look from this perspective, we don't have much options, do we? If you look from here. That's really much difficult. We must be almost playing like this. Ooh, oh, we can go somewhere there as well. Interesting, but I don't see nothing. Actually, we must be, realistically speaking, we must be playing like this. Where are we gonna go? But this is not realistically. Is there anywhere we can climb? 
Hmm. We, we gotta go up. We gotta, what is this? This is sun sign. I've not seen that before. How do we get there? How do we get there? Yep, think we got... Yeah, we're gonna waste some energy, I think. And some dangerous locations here. This is all ice. Hopefully we won't fall to our deaths so soon. Before we even can do anything. Uh, that's gonna cost us a lot of energy. It's gonna cost a lot of energy. No, can we go? No, 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 no. Can you go here? No, 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 stop it. Can you go here? Here, here, here. E that's dangerous. That's a lot of danger. Then, can we go somewhere differently? Can we go around? No, are we gonna risk it? Are we gonna risk it? I think we can. I wanna go to that sun sign. I don't know what it is. I wanna risk it. Let's go. Let's see if we can... Ooh, it has begun to storm. Oh no, there it is, rough stone. While moving through through rough stony terrain, you step on a treacherous piece of rock, twisting your ankle. Oh my god, I twisted an ankle. There we go, we've got a penalty already, temporary, for 15 hours. Energy cost on all terrain. This is where I'm gonna use this one. Yep, now we've got, instead of minus 30, plus 10. Ah, oh, that's a shame, that's a shame, that's a shame, that's a shame. Well, the cave is too early, got two encounters which we're gonna do, and then we're gonna try to climb there and know what it is. Nearby an abundant camp, there is a torn tent. You could take the time to search the intact tent. Take a quick look around, search thoroughly. If we search thoroughly... Well, we've got a cave nearby, so let's do it. Find some equipment. <gasps> Flashlight! Nice! And experience points, which means we... Where do we put it? Aha! Okay, so it's either the climbing tool or the light. Okay, now we've leveled up. That we have as well. There are temporary things for 84 hours. Uh, 48 hours and other permanent things. Warm thoughts. Whenever you use... A um uh, a consumable item gain four body temperature that's actually good as well we're probably gonna need that let's pick the permanent things first now almost night time oh no 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 let's go here yep that should do so let's go first talk to this person or whatever encounter that is there we go let's see you gaze around, you notice a faint light in the distance. It flits back and forth. Continue my journey. Uh, no, let's approach it carefully. As you get closer, you realize it's fireflies. What a beautiful and unexpected light show. That's XP and sanity. We still got time? Let's see. That cost us how much hours? Just a little bit. Good enough to get back. That's good. We, we're gonna do that. We can uh, we can go about to eight hours at night, at the evening, so that once we return, so that when we sleep, we will wake up exactly at daytime, or at least at. Uh... Oh, a tent hastily erect against the side of the rock wall catches your attention. As you get closer, you discover a sleeping mountaineer. His clothes are torn in places, and you can tell by his face that he's in a bad shape. You can say how long he has left to live or whether he will make it. Uh-oh. No, no. Try to help him. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to... Um, I know every. I know it is a difficult, diff dangerous uh, life being a mountaineer. We're going to help each other as much as we can. Let's go. You roll the stranger into a recovery position and speak to him in a soothing voice. Despite your efforts, he makes no sign and does not move. You cannot help him. Oh, that's very shame. Um, okay, this is another permanent one. Whenever you wake up, gain four energy, four body... Oh, yes. Yes, until the mission ends. That's perfect. Uh, nighttime. How much do we have to get here? A lot of hours, and then we want to get back to the cave. How much is that? Ooh, that's too long. That's too long. Mm, yep, we're gonna go through this risky area. That's what we're gonna do. That's our best option. And then let's go through this one. Then we go on... Those those are two special things behind each other. But it's all ice. I wanna go, go away from this ice area. I don't like it. But this left side doesn't seem good either, doesn't it? 
Seems a lot like danger and, and, and snow and we are not at the 6,000 altitude, so that's okay. Um, you enter the cave con cautiously. A short way ahead, the ground disappears. There is a wide, deep fold in the earth in front of you, stretching from one wall to another. Explore it. You squint down and make something uh, lying at the bottom of the fold. From the distance, it looks like it might be a backpack or a bag. Could there be a valuable equipment inside? Uh, yeah. Yeah, use, uh, use my flashlight. You move further and further into the cave system. The knocking of muffling and... The muffled and regular as it... As if coming from a broken machine. Then suddenly, silence. You wait for a moment, but nothing happens. Strange. You're about to turn around and go back when you discover a metallic chest in a niche. You open it and find some equipment. Guess this detour was worth it. Oxygen. I guess every oxygen we need is... We didn't have any oxygen. I know this now. Uh, lie down and sleep. Long sleep? Yeah, because if we reach a 6000 altitude, we're probably gonna need it. There we go. There we go. Only a couple more hours left now to... Oh, there is a cave at the bottom as well. But now, how can we reach it? Is that the best option? I think we're gonna go one by one. Can we circle around here? No, we can actually not. Okay, so... Um, let's say we use the flashlight for a second. Let's move straight. Uh -huh, there is a chest as well. Okay, but I really want to go to that side. I really want to go to there. Uh, okay, let's move. Now let's take the pickaxe because we know where we gotta go now. Okay, nice. Light time! Yay! Light. Is this the best option? That is the best option. That's going to consume a lot of energy. But let's go since we are adventurers. We are mountaineers. Let's speed it up a little bit. There we go. Then we okay. Then we have a clear pathway to the towards this one. Then we've got something there. There we do need to find a cave because I don't really want to waste the tents. Melody, you lean back against the rock face. A distant melody reaches your ear, soft and tender and beautiful. You close your eyes for a moment, breathe deeply and evenly. You keep listening. The music seems to be coming from inside the mountain. Could it be yet another legacy of the occupiers? Or maybe its origins are more mysterious. Whatever it is, it makes you smile. Oh, XP and sanity. Beautiful. Nice. Anything? Oh, yeah. More take it slow. Explore the mountain. That only... F mm, no. Let's take permanent things. I like things that are permanent. Ah, that's a lot of energy. Don't seem... Don't, it doesn't seem like we have a choice here. Then we've got ice. Ice, 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 which is all difficult to rain. A shrine. That's we, that we are not going to read, but we are going to take some energy. Now. Chest. Person. Chest. And we need to climb up. And I think the best way is to go deeper inside this part of the mountain and not there. That doesn't give us any good. So, uh, no, that's not... Yeah, uh, that's... Aren't there any difficult, different ways? No. Oh, that's less risky. That's only two. Okay, this one is less risky. Let's go like this. Okay, we're lucky. No, 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 cr no crazy events. No crazy events. Still alive. Still alive. Uh, chest. Ooh, a lot of danger zones. A lot of... That's only one... Uh, ooh, that's a big detour there. Yeah, but we're gonna go. Mm, we don't have any choice. Can we not go? Okay, uh, this. We're gonna take the risk. One, two, three. Uh, yep, let's take the risk. Let's take the risk. Do we see any caves? What is that there? That's no cave. Uh oh, ice fall. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, no, no, okay, that's the chest area, okay, I think. Towering in front of you on the slope are bizarre-shaped masses of ice and snow. It's several tents not far away. Who set camp? Check the slopes. I go to the tent first, approach the camp. 
You slowly approach the camp, the ice scrunches beneath your boots. Every step could be your last. You close your eyes. Finally, you reach your goal. The camp has been abandoned. With not a soul in sight, they surely left long ago. <sighs> XP. Ooh, a lot of body heat lost. And what do we get? Increase the body temperature by moving and searching. Nice. Oh. Thank you. Guys, we are going actually very good. Very, very good. I must say. Okay, there we can definitely... Uh, no, let's say here, here, and here. There we go. We are running low on energy, though. That's a problem. We're going to be a problem sooner or later. But we've got two canned food. Okay, this is good. Wolf's head. Uh, examine. Stay and examine the relic. How much energy do we have, then? Only one. Okay, we only have one energy left. That, that That's okay. You're astounded by the delicate craftsmanship. How old must this wolf head be? One thing is clear. People once lived here and erected impressive structures. But what kind of civilization was it? And why have you ever... Why have you never heard of him? As you ruminate on the many unanswered questions, your eyes wander to a small chest. Provisions? A moon herb? Okay... Okay, we're getting low on stuff. Let's try eating a canned food to get our energy back a little bit. Uh, that's good. Can we get her any safer way? We've got energy left then? We do. Hmm, it's getting colder, guys. We are really losing energy constantly. It's not good. It's not good. I want to use the flashlight for more light, but I don't see any value to it. Okay, there's an active fire pit. Oh, yeah, fire pit. Yeah, give me energy. Uh, warmth, yeah, yeah, warmth. I guess this will be the very first time that... Oh, there is a cave, but how long will that... How far? Oh, we don't have enough energy. We don't have enough energy. Nope. We're gonna sleep here. I guess this will be the first time using a tent. Uh, sleep long. Body heat... Not so much body heat. Oh, how can we replenish body heat better, guys? That is a problem. That is a severe problem. Uh, let's read the... Okay. Thick air. Oxygen per hour when moving. Not... Yeah, okay. Um, plus one body temperature per hour when moving. Okay. Sanity... Uh, minus sanity when moving. Basic values. Ah, that's the insurmountable uh, difficulty. And fur gloves. No, we, we, per hour we're moving. Okay, so we do get a little bit of energy back. So that's okay. Take it slow. Whenever you use a consumable, you get... Okay, we're okay, guys. We're okay. We, we've, we've got ways to get our um, resources back. That's too high. Don't like that. Do I... Do we see... Oh, there is a cave. Yes, we're gonna go there. That's a path we must choose. Um, how about we go this? This uses minus 13. And if I use the straight path, this uses minus 18. So we must a little bit coordinate ourselves to make it more, uh, more efficient. Oh yeah, there we go. You see, we get a little bit body temperature. That's good. That's okay. Uh, here is not much choice except... Oh, eagles. Nice. Eagles. Beautiful. I must say this is a very enjoyable... Oh, let's look down. We've come a long way. The snow in your feet is churning up as if it recently moved around. Could somebody have been digging here? I dig deeper. I dig around just beneath the... No, no, we dig deeper. You kneel down and use your hands to dig through the snow. You can feel the cold creeping up your arms. Bandages! Nice. Only wins. Have not lost anything yet. Can we get their uh, resourceful? No, let's go. This is basic. Then we go here. Can we get towards there first? I think we. Aha, uh -huh. this is a dangerous terrain. But what if we go. We go like this, this, and this? 
Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. This should be... Mm, we can always do it in the morning. We can always do it in the morning. We're running out of energy. Let's do it step by step, shall we? Let's just go step by step and see what's uh, what's there before we make any rash decisions. Okay, now we go here. This is rough terrain, isn't it? It is. Hmm. I don't want to go on... I think if I go on this icon, I will lose it if we want to sleep. That's what I think. Two difficult icons. Ah, uh, let's risk it. And now we must not risk it in something as dangerous as mountain climbing. I uh, run around to make a detour. Oh, okay. Okay. That, did that do anything? You test the rocks, but there's a major red flex here. One false move and you will start an avalanche. It will be better to find a detour. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Went well. Everything went good. Oh, and we have slowly regained a lot of body temperature. More warmth. Yeah. Okay, guys. We are full on body temperature. Oh, that's a snow icon. What is a snow icon? That's something dangerous, probably. What is this? Show mission. Show skills. No, that's not what we need. This looks dangerous. But, uh, no. Let's go here and then there. Okay, it's nighttime. Perfect. 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 Now we can go sleep. No problems. Everything is cozy and good. Cave. Uh, yeah, let's follow the light. See what it is. What is this? A oh, fireflies. Okay, we've got a little bit of sanity back, which is perfect. And now we need to go sleep a long, long sleep. Plus 2.2 body heat. That's amazing. The energy doesn't return that good, doesn't it, guys? Only f uh, 52 energy. That's not exactly what we'd be like. Reduce penalty for sleeping without a tent. Hmm. Stay warm. <gasps> More. Whenever you cons Yes, more body temperature when moving. That's good. Consumable. No, no, no. This one. Yes, please. Yes. More body temperature per hour when moving. That's good. Okay, now we are... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <gasps> okay, there is a pathway through the right. Aha, uh -huh, there is a pathway to the left. As okay, I was a little bit panicking there. I do see a cave there and there, but... Ah, is it even possible to get there? We're gonna we are left or right? Oh, we're almost there, guys. Almost. Shall we take the right? Can we zoom out a little bit more? I do see a cave there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that's not how you. I know it's not realistic, but I want to do it. Oh, oh, what is that? What is that icon? What is that icon? What is that icon? I don't like that. I don't like that. Then we go left. That's the same difficult icon. Let's you hold the phone. Hold the phone. Let's use this one. Um, is that a waste? Is that is, is that a waste of body temperature? Uh, how much do we have? No, okay. Uh, only if really necessary, we will use the consumable to get more energy back. I think we must rest more. The, oh, this is the the air is getting thinner, you and your breath is heavy. You have entered the death zone. You pause for a moment to prepare for this uh, to prepare for the difficult path towards the summit. I will take it slow. What does that mean? Plus one oxygen when moving. Okay, I will ascend as quickly as possible. Less energy cost on all terrain. Before I ascend, I will mend to my wounds. I don't have any wounds. Wounds. We only have one oxygen thing, so I think this is our best option, guys. We only have one oxygen thingy. A backpack. You find a backpack. Search the backpack. The boot prints lead away from the spot. Follow the tracks. Oh, okay, let's go. You grab the backpack and follow the tracks. You spot a tent sheltered from a wind between two sheer rocks faces. You can hear a loud snoring coming from inside. You cautiously approach. Suddenly, a bleary-eyed, haggard face pops out of the tent flap the snorer smiles at you as he spots the backpack in your outstretched hand 
Stranger takes the backpack and reaches inside. He rummages around and pulls you out a can of food, which they offer to you. You aren't sure if you should accept the gift. After all, the stranger is thin as a rail and probably needs the food more than you do. Thank him and decline the gift. Sanity per hour? Sanity in a vein gets. Um, let's not accept it. I know that would probably be my final... That was probably a, uh, uh, a bad choice, I guess. Anyways, gotta get towards the cave there. Can we? That's far. That's far. That's very far. I don't even know if we can get there. Can we go? Oh, it's also dangerous. Every terrain here is dangerous. Oh, those are ice glaciers. How are we? We're gonna sleep here. Then we go probably... <sighs> That's a steep climb there. That's a very steep climb. God damn it. Uh, there. We cannot make it. Or maybe we can. He says 17 energy. But I, th I think I'm going to use it now. Why? Because if we trigger a, a weird event, we're going to get screwed badly. If we need energy, which we don't have to use. Oxygen is decreasing as well. No effects, no effects, no effects. Oh no, a corpse. Oh no, I searched thoroughly, yep. A vacuum flask. Oh, hot tea, thank you. At least it's something. Can we still move? I don't think we can, so we're gonna take a short rest. Uh, maybe... Ex no, 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 not explore, lie down and rest. Briefly... Or a long rest. Minus oxygen. Oh no. Then we're going to take the long rest. We are definitely going to take the long rest. Okay, now we are going to pop our um, gas, uh, our oxygen flask. Okay, we're going to use this one. There we go. Let's say how much that's not ideal. No, that's not ideal. That's a lot of danger. Um, what is the best way to go there? That's dangerous and I don't see any point where we can chill out. We need a god damn it oxygen mask, guys. Def is this a detour? This does seem like a detour, although I think we can maybe preserve some energy afterwards. Do you have anything? We don't have anything. Let's see if we can even make there. Let's just go. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, was it was this the only option? Oh no, I just noticed that. Ah, uh, there is a cave as well, but if we rest, we lose air. We lose oxygen. And we only have received one oxygen flask. I didn't know that was so, so, so important. I mean, I, of course it's important, but I, I thought we could probably regain it differently. Uh oh. Oh no. I move carefully. Um, Move carefully. Slowly climb from a rock. The boulder wobbly slightly under your weight, but it holds. <gasps> Thank God. Thank God. Nothing happened. Thank you. Thank you very much. Please, oxygen. Oxygen, oxygen. Oxy oxygen bottle! Oxygen bottle! Oxygen bottle. I dig towards the oxygen bottle. Yeah, I don't care about the heat or the energy. We need it. We need it. Yeah. Give it to us. Give it to us. We need it. There we go. Okay, guys, we're safe. It was a good decision. It was a good decision. Um. Yeah, yeah. Now, now we even can rest. Is this all danger zone? Oh no, that's not danger zone. That uses only how much energy? Twenty-two. And straight up uses twenty-seven. Okay. So no, 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 no. You're gonna go here. Here. Yep. There. And then there. Yeah, that's good. Let's go, man. It should be good. We are. And the higher we get, the more lighter it is. Oh my god, that's so high! Oh, this is epic. We're almost at the top of the mountain. 
Almost at the top of the mountain. Uh, this was something good. I know that. That's oxygen or energy. Um, yeah, oxygen. Because we, we can rest. We can definitely rest. Um, are we going to do that now? Are we going to rest now? Let's see what that uh, what that's what, what that's gonna do. A short rest will reduce our oxygen, but a lot of energy. A long rest will give us how? What's the difference between thirty-two? Ah, uh, do we need? I think we need it. I think we need it. Let's sleep. I think we need it. I'm I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not a mountain climbing expert, but I think we need it. Uh, now we're gonna pop up the pop the oxygen. Now we pop the oxygen. Has this been deactivated again? Let's use it once more. There we go. Less energy consumption. Less energy consumption. Can we reach it? What is that? No, not enough energy. What is that? That's a human. That's something to talk to. Is that the best option we can do? Is this not better? Let me see. And now you go there. That uses how much? 41. And you advise me to do what? 45. So that's a little bit more. Is there anything interesting there at that side? No. Now, guys? This is... I mean, it is badass that you want to climb a mountain. But have you thought about going down, by the way? I don't think you have. So, uh... Let's go there then. I don't even know if we will make it back down. Hopefully you have a cell phone so we can call a chopper to get us, to save us. Okay. Almost. Oh, the finish line is so close. It's so close, guys. Oh, I don't see anything special on this side except for the... <gasps> That thing gives us... That thing gives us something. That thing gives us something. Uh, does it give energy? Uh-oh. Oh, no. It's okay. Okay, okay. It's, it's nightfall. That's good. It's good. Come on. Come on. You can do this. This person must have something for us to use. Saint Bernard. <gasps> oh! Oh, Serge back. Dogo. Thank you, Dogo. The dog waits patiently. Thank you, Dogo. We've got boots. Boots give us energy cost on snow. And we've got another tea. Thank you, Dogo. Okay. What can I get from this? Warmth or energy? Energy. We must be climbing, guys. We don't have a freaking... Yes, we're gonna make it. We just have enough energy to do this. We just have enough energy to do this. At the summit, your heart feels light and full of joy as you stand on the summit. The hardship of the climb already forgotten, you savor the moment. It is yours and yours alone. What an adventure, what a view. Off in the distance, you can see more mountains higher, even more, ev higher even than the one you are at standing on. And what's that? Something stands atop top of one of them, long and thin. From this distance it looks like an antenna, but that can't be right, or can it? You want to take a closer look, you aren't done exploring yet. But first you have to get out of the dead zone and find a safe place to take a break. Energy, body heat, oxygen, we are full. Oh, it is not done. Whenever you reach a point of interest, gain sanity. Reduce the time cost when moving. Reduce the energy in all terrains. I think that's the most important thing at the moment. But we have reached the summit. And I did thought it was weird. Oh, that's a long way down. But guys... We will leave that for the next episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you liked the game, guys. If you did, drop a comment down below. And as always, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. Drop a comment down below, guys. And I will see you in the next episode. Have a great day, everyone.